CSST, Corrugated Stainless Steel Tubing. This is becoming a more common place item. It's a flexible gas line for propane or natural gas and its purpose is to make installation easier rather than running black iron pipe. Now I'm a novice, I'm not an expert on heating and propane or propane accessories, but I've been researching these products for use in my garage and Gas Tight and Proflex seem to be the two brands that are prevalent right now for the consumer market. There are other brands out there that seem to be mostly only sold to pro installers, but if you go look at Home Depot or eBay, you're going to find Proflex and Gas Tight. Now, these are both similar and different in a number of ways. These are both made out of Type 304 stainless steel, and the jackets are both made out of polyethylene. Now, you'll notice that even though they're both made out of stainless steel, they're two different colors. That's because the gas tight is annealed, it's heat treated, and that supposedly makes it more flexible. Another thing that I noticed when looking at these two is the seam on the stainless steel. The one on the gas tight seems to be a lot smoother, while the one on the Proflex um, is a little bit rougher. As to whether that makes any difference whatsoever in the functionality, I don't know. I'm just presenting my observations here. There's a lot of debate over the safety of CSST, such as during lightning strikes or putting a nail through it during construction or remodeling. Uh, so the nail, yes, that's an obvious hazard. You need to place this stuff where it won't get hit by nails or you need to put armor plates where it's at risk. Another thing is you need to use bonding clamps on CSST lines. These are to ground it uh, and that is supposed to uh, provide some safety, I guess, against lightning strikes and other hazards of that nature. That's all I'm going to say about its safety. Um, as far as its actual functionality, the jackets are the same, the materials are the same. This one is annealed, this one is not. Now, the gas tight claims to be 0 .010 inches thick. I couldn't find a thickness on the stainless steel wall of the Proflex but from what I've read, the most common thickness for CSST is uh, 0.008. Now, the jackets on them are made of the same material, slightly different colors, um, and the one on the gas tight seems to have a little more flex to it than the one on the Proflex, not that that should really make any difference. The difference in space between the ridges seems to be different. When you line them up, they don't fit exactly. And this is something that I read about. I was trying to find out whether the fittings for the different types were compatible between the different brands of tubing, and I read that they are not. And now I can see here the reason for that. These are not made to the same dimensions. Now let's look at the actual fittings themselves. This is the Proflex, this is the gas tight. There's a big difference in the construction of these fittings and how they go together. I'm not going to get into assembly instructions because there's instructions available on, online for that and I'm probably not qualified to teach you about it. But you can see that the gas tight simply has three pieces. A collar, the fitting, and the nut. Whereas the Proflex has a nut, a washer, a washer, a seal, there's another seal inside of there, and then your final fitting. So big difference in construction here. And just from observation, I have not assembled any of this stuff yet. It looks like the gas tight 
has a simpler installation with less to go wrong just based on the number of components. The ProFlex itself sure does look complicated. Lots of fittings, lots of seals. Both of these products meet the same certifications and standards. The ProFlex seems to be slightly less expensive than the Gastite. Whether or not there's any actual difference in performance, I don't know. I don't have a way to test that. So those are the differences. I just thought I would present them to you. You can make your own conclusions. Hopefully it'll help you make a decision when you're trying to select yours.